I learned is uh, those type of players, those top class players, their ability to play inside and out, and also their work rate. You know, their work rate on and off the footy. Um, you know, they win the footy inside, but they also get themselves in positions to receive on the outside. Pretty smart players too, so they can go forward, kick goals, and uh, basically if you stop concentrating any time, they'll uh, take you to pieces. For myself, um, I'm looking forward to it this year because since uh, my three years at the club, I haven't had a full pre-season. You know, a few different injuries in, uh, with my foot and my hip, so up to this point I'm injury free, so I think that's going to hold me in good stead for the, for the year. Uh, also with my fitness too, so it's giving me a good base to be able to work on. Uh, also uh, skills by foot as well, that's what I'm looking at improving. So you know, when I again get the footy opportunity to play on these good players, I want to hurt them on, uh, whenever I get the footy and offensively. I just want to make it an easy transition for the young guys to come through. Also give them an example to lead by. They want to be uh, approachable, so just as I was coming into a new club, what I'd look for in a leader. And uh, yeah, that's basically what, I, what I'm looking for. I think the whole squad's training well. Uh, I know there's a few young boys doing, you know, standing out a little bit. Bonner, um, you know, Tommy Allard, those type of boys coming out of the system. Uh, and all the uh, senior boys, Nuggets, always having a good pre-season. Adam Marklon's training well again, Paul Durago. So it's hard to pinpoint them. But um, yeah, looking forward to it. I think it's going to be exciting.